to what it is from there, just to have a quick look at um, my interpretation of Bruce Lee's martial art. Now, I don't pretend to be uh, an expert or anything, there's definitely some people more skillful than I, so I'm not here to, uh, you know, to say that, oh, this is Jikundo, this is how it's done, right? I leave that to certain people, like Tommy Carruthers, definitely if you want to learn Jikundo, go ahead and see that guy, because he's the guy that taught me the most stuff about Jikundo that I know of, just to give credit where they're due, because it's definitely a... Uh, Good, you know what I mean? I'm very grateful for what I learned from him. So what I'm going to show you now is what I retained from it, what I got from it. Okay. And from there, really thinking that uh, we think about three different targets, yeah. So the eyes, yeah, the groin, yeah, and then the kneecaps, okay, which is the main three targets that we go for. High jab, boom, groin kick, boom, side kick to the knee or to the groin. Closest weapon to nearest target, yeah, would dictate that I'm gonna lose, I'm gonna use my longest weapon to his closest target. And that would be side kick to the knee, okay? So I would have this, yeah. I'm going easy obviously because I don't want to damage him. Even with that, you could actually damage somebody. So from there, kind of leaning back, attacking, yeah, attacking the the kneecap. From there, you got the groin kick, okay? There, the various groin kick. Okay, and from there you got the eye jab. Be on the side here and get get the eye. Okay, get the eye target. That yeah, could go side kick, back switch, side kick to the groin. From there I get clipped if I stay here. So I want to move away. I want to move away and get the kneecap from there. Yeah, I'm here. I'm here. Yeah. I'm here. I'm here. I'm here. I'm here. Then I got this, and then I got the eye jab. Or I got the eye jab first, and then the groin kick. I could go eye jab, groin kick, side kick. Whether I enter with an eye jab, or a groin kick, or a side kick, if I do my job right, I don't need to do anything anymore. And if I do my job right, I'm there, crack, and I'm gone, dealing with somebody else, or going through the exit. If I, my, if I do my job right, boom, easy my money, here, I'm, I'm off. But I could also follow up, okay? Same thing here, if I'm successful with a high job and he's here, why would I need to do anything more? There's the exit, there's my wife, my kids, let's go, gone, yeah? But for the sake of uh, following up, if you had to, what you could do from there, you're here, there, back, you can continue. So you see the groin here, you can attack the groin here, the plexus, you got, you know, there, groin kick, straight lead. If I miss him, here, I got this. Let's say I'm missing that way, and I got the back fist here, entry, entry, and as, after the groin kick, bam, I'm here, bam, here, and I got this, yeah. Same again, groin kick, there, I got this, and what I'm gonna do is I'm using, once again, Falling step, footwork, bam, bam, here, bam, there, bam, there. I got a knee to crack here, or an ankle to crack here. I got the groin to get here. Maybe I got a hand here, well, yeah. So, you could, yes, finish with your feet after, if you have to, yeah. But the entry, think about it. Entry, follow up, finish. The way that I'm seeing it. It's not necessarily the way that uh, it's been explained to me, but that's the way that I like to explain it to people to understand how it works. Entries, follow up, finish. So entries from far away, get in. Entry, here. And then maybe something else. Entry, here. Finish with that. Yeah. What else? Maybe entries here. Boom, here. Once I'm here, there is a hand here, crack that, yeah? There is a hand here, kick that, yeah? Now what have you got? Knee, ankle, groin, yeah? And of course, depending here, maybe the head, here. So I go, boom, the groin kick, boom, the head. Finish with that, for example. Here. Uh, I, can, I can do all this stuff as well, 
once you get to that, that distance, you closed in, yeah? I thought you got to beat him down. I thought you got to beat him down with shot, yeah? Or you can take him down. So I could be here, there, and I got this here, yeah? and I got this. I got this, and I got this from here, bam, from here, yeah? I like to be here and grab this ballistic limb. And now I got this, yeah? I like all the head takedowns because wherever the head goes, the body goes, man. Oh. So if I'm here, bam, here, bam, I'm here, yeah? and now I got this. Same principle, what was it? Entry, entry, bam, here. Now I'm using a, a UC move, which is more like a, a, a chin rip. Bam. Turn that here, and I'm only finishing with this. Bam, here, bam, here, bam, here, bam, here, bam, here. yeah? There, bam here, bam here, bam here, yeah, bam here, yeah. Or I'm there, I'm there, he blocks, boom. I'm doing something else, bam, and then I'm here. I'm here, he blocks, am I just the one he blocks again? Boom, I disengage, I do something else. So I'm here, bam, yeah, you get him on the second shot. Bam, bam, and then disengage. Bam, I take, bam, bam, you know, I continue with, with the highlight. I'm here, there, bam here, bam, back here. Crack here, that ankle. I'm here, there, I'm there, I'm here. Crack here, yeah? If his head is here, I got this. If his head is this, I got this. You know what I mean? If his head is like this, I got this, I got this. If I'm here, boom, here, static. Could be really close, there, scooping. Could be a bit further away, point, yeah? Could also be far where I can't get in, now I have to use my footwork. Boom, and come back to a kicking distance. Or I could choose to stay there. Boom, boom, there. Yeah? So, different types of footwork that you can use depending on what you want to do. Yeah? There. Punch with the other hand. There. Try and kick. Yeah. Yeah? You intercept before. Because remember, a straight line is always quicker than curb line. So if he tries and kick like this, yeah? I see it. He tries to kick, boom. As he's here, his groin is a bit more close. As he's opening up that stance to, to kick, boom. And he offers me an opportunity to strike. Boom, boom. There. Yeah? And from there, once, once he's down, once he's down here, look. Bang, you got this here. Hammer face. This is more combative, yeah? I didn't see Tommy do stuff like that, but I like it because it's there. The target is there. Really, JKD would be more like, bam here, see here, bam here, bam here. Yeah, that would be a way to, to finish. Using boxing combos to follow up, yeah. So you get, you get the principle of what it is. So it's very simple stuff, it's not complicated. Really what you want at first is focus on these three targets. So I'm here, high jab, boom, groin kick, boom, side kick, to the knee or to the groin.